All right. So just wanted to do a quick video and answer a question that came up in a group today. I posted a response to a question last night where someone was basically saying, hey, what do you guys think about business cards? And um, my response was, I think they're a great thing, uh, you know, especially when you're in person. It's still, I think, pretty common for someone to say, uh, well, let, let let me think about this some, and uh, do you have a business card you can leave with me? So you can debate whether they actually would ever look at it again or, or whatever, but at least you're able to hand them something that they're asking for, something that they uh, think of traditionally as a way that you kind of transact business. So uh, there are still a lot of people, I think, that are that way, especially businesses. I've found actually going to businesses and um, talking to them, they still want to ask for a business card. But what I, what I also responded to is to say, hey, what I think is good to have as well, certainly give the business card if you have one, but use a Facebook Messenger code, scan code, so that you can immediately be connected. I know a lot of people, um, you know, these days will take the time to say, okay, hey, let's friend each other on Facebook and and. Although you can do that if you're if you're really pressed for time, that that can get kind of cumbersome because you might say, you know, someone's got a really difficult name and you're asking them how to spell it and all that kind of crazy stuff. So it can be a little awkward. But what's really easy is to scan this code. So several people were like, hey, that sounds like a really cool idea, but I've never even heard of it. How do you get your code? How do you scan it? that type of thing. So I'm going to try to do this video really quickly and show you. So what you should see on the screen here over to the far right is a um, basically a, a, a capture of my phone screen. And then here kind of more in the middle of the screen is an actual code that I use. This code actually will take uh, the person that scans it to a, a home detox class that I've set up that, that is basically delivered through Facebook Messenger, the actual content and is on a Facebook page. Uh, maybe that's for another video, but nonetheless, I want you to see that I've got a code. This is the end result. I want to be able to get to this code. Um, I want to know how to scan it, so forth and so on. So what we're going to talk about is how to get your personal Facebook Messenger code so that you can share that with others so that you can scan it. There are Facebook Messenger codes for pages. There aren't Facebook Messenger codes for groups, but nonetheless, there are Facebook Messenger codes for pages, but I'm not going to talk about that in this video. So let's get right to it. As you'll see, I've got my phone here. I'm going to click in the top left uh, on the icon for the Messenger, and this is an iPhone, by the way. And also, it's the latest version of Messenger, as far as I know, from the App Store. If you were to research this, there's a lot of videos out there that are pretty much out of date if you have the latest version of Messenger because things have changed. So I'm going to click on Messenger. It's going to come up. And and what you want to do here now is, again, click in the top left. Right next to where it says People, click on your profile picture. And bang, there's your code right there. Now, also, now touch the code picture and you'll notice it puts it right in the middle of the screen and this is what you would do if you want to basically hold up your phone and say hey scan my code uh, I want to show you one other thing before we talk about scanning but it's it's really that simple that is now that's what your scan code is but let's say you want to save that off and include it in the email uh, post it to um, Twitter put it on Instagram, whatever you want to do, you want to set, you need to save it off. So you click over here in the top right, the icon there that shows the arrow going up with a box. Click on that. Now you've got several different options. I'm going to say you can't really see it because of this thing that's covered, but I'm going to click on save image down here. That saves it to my uh, camera roll basically. And now that's saved. So I will show you that it's there. So I'm going to go over here, go to camera. That's just the quickest way I get to the last pictures that I've taken. Click on it, and then there's my picture. So you can you can imagine you can do any number of things with that now that you have it. So now let's talk about scanning the code. 
And how do you do that? So I'm going to move this back over. And um, now if you want to scan someone's code, let's back out again. There's actually a couple of ways to get to this. I'll, I'll try to show you them both. This is the first screen in Messenger. Uh, the first way to do it, kind of the easiest, I think, is again, click on your profile next to people. Click on your actual scan code. Now go to scan code. Instead of my code, go to the one to the right of it, which says scan a code. And we're going to scan a code. Now you get this big round circle. I'm going to pick up my phone. I'm going to focus it, which I just did on that scan code that's in the middle of the screen. And you'll notice that it basically now has subscribed me to this uh, healthy home detox class. And now this person's interacting with that and you know, getting their their class. So that's that's uh, the first way. One other quick way I'll show you. Again, we're to the beginning of the messenger screen. Uh, you'll see three icons down at the bottom, the one right in the middle, which looks like a person with uh, it says 132. I guess that's the number of messages. I don't know what that number is, actually. But if you click on that. That icon down at the bottom, um, it pulls up this. Now I go up to the top and click on that person that shows a plus up there, top right. And now you see here over to the left, scan code. So I can click on scan code and it basically puts it in the mode to scan first. You can click over here, go to my code. So, again, what I think is honestly easier is to um, click on people, click on your picture, and then either my code or scan code. Either one of those works. So, I think that covers it. Um, I've showed you how to get your code. I've showed you how to scan someone's code. Uh, basically, that picture in the middle of the code is your profile picture. So, if you change your profile... What I've done in the past, if I want something different in the middle of the scan code um, and then print it out, I'll change my profile picture long enough to uh, have that show up and then you could change it back to something else. I mean, once you've downloaded the code, you're good with regard to printing. Now, if you pull it up within Messenger, it's obviously going to be whatever your profile picture is right now. So hope this video helps. And um, have a good day.